It is Wednesday, May the 11th, and uh, let me do this. That's right, you're right here at Galaxy 107 FM. Got to welcome along everybody that's joining us this morning on Facebook Live. Also, if you're going to be watching, yeah, just a little later on over there on YouTube, you know what to do, right? No, you do. You really do. Sub, thumb, bell, bingo. You're right there. Uh, subscribe, go on, I dare you. Become a member of the uh, Galaxy family people we call the noise, and believe me, the noise is growing globally on a daily basis, we dare you to subscribe. Also, uh, notifications, you know the bell? Yeah, make sure that that's alerted so that we can tell you that we have important people for interviews coming up, and believe me, you're going to absolutely love this one. Thumb? Well, get epileptic with the thumb. I dare you, I double dare you, I just go for it, believe me. And uh, today, I am excited, and I'll tell you why, Viking Queen are in the house. Hell yeah. Yeah, absolutely, they really, really are. But we've got to say how excited we are, not only to be interviewing today Viking Queen, uh, but being in, in association with Rise Up TV, Big Records, and of course, Sony Music, The Orchard, right here at Galaxy. Check this out. <laughs> Another indie artist interview brought to you by Galaxy 107 FM in association with Rise Up TV. Big record is Sony Music The Watcher. Now, we thought it would be remiss of us if we didn't start off the show with the uh, Global Metalist United. We are United track. This is really, really relevant for right now, especially what's happening in the Ukraine. And that is what it's based on. Believe me, we're going to talk about that and uh, why it was put together, how proceeds are going, all that sort of thing, right after this. Here they are, Global Medalists United. We are united here at Galaxy. <laughs> Tim's our case, isn't he? Yeah. <laughs> dear, oh dear, oh dear. Oh dear. Raywin Shaw is joining us. Nice to have you on board, Raywin. And uh, Lewis. Hi, Raywin. I'm sorry I couldn't be at the uh, Karen's 50th in the weekend. I'm going to be this weekend. Oh, weekend. was Raywin one of the young ladies yeah. that went out on the town that yeah, night, was she? And she yeah. didn't get arrested? No. Ah, she didn't have me with her then. Hi, George. <laughs> Sandy's on board as well. George, nice to have you on board, my bro. It is an absolute pleasure, and believe me, today I'm really excited because we're catching up good friends of ours, Viking Queen. Of course, we're talking to Gay Miranda and brand spanking new lead singer, Francis LeCuan. Uh, and uh, guys, welcome back. It's nice to see you guys having a beer and, and a, a good drink. Uh, what is it, about midnight over there? Happy to be on board. Okay. Yeah, it's good to uh, see you back again, my friend. Yeah. So we have a, a lot of things to, uh, some happening now around working cream and uh, and uh, uh, it's really, as I can say, it's, it's big change about everything. We have beautiful front singer now and uh, and. Uh, the band has changed to more harder. You know, I, I get it. I really do. And you know something? I think it's deserved as well. Uh, but I wouldn't call them beautiful. I'd call them handsome, but I wouldn't call them beautiful. No. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> um, but having said that, who is the person next to you? I think I've seen him before in some of the videos yep. you've seen. Uh, it's a really famous TV star in Scandinavia. Okay. All right. Well, nice to meet you, sir. Yeah. Last bit, can I ask you a question? Yes, sir. Can I destroy your show a little bit? Can I? Sorry? Can I destroy your show a little bit? Yes, go for it. Okay. <clears throat> if they're doing quite fast, what are you doing on your spare time? What do I do in my spare time? Uh, I drive cars fast. Uh, no, I, I drive my car 
sideways. I do it fast. I, I, I like to take a Gretchen out on the uh, back roads of where we are around here. And I listen to all the new music. You know, I play music that makes you want to drive fast. So, but that's my spare time. I, I'm lucky if I get maybe 10 minutes, 20 minutes a day, I collate that together, I might get half a day on a Saturday. <laughs> Are you involved in the Revision School game? Yeah, school. 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 <laughs> well, I'm, I'm having a coffee, so school. <laughs> okay, so, so do you have plans to come over to uh, New Zealand uh, to have this Revision Rednecks TV? I'm um, loving that idea. No, awesome I'm, I'm loving that idea. Um, and in fact, I, I want to talk to you about something once we've finished this gear. Uh, that may yeah. excite you. It really, really might. And it might tie in with what yeah. you're planning on coming to New Zealand or France. I'd love to have you in New Zealand. I really, really would. It'd be a pleasure to have you on New Zealand stages. So, thank you. Let's go to the next. We've got about 40 seconds to go. <laughs> Right, you're right here at Galaxy 107 FM. It's such a pleasure to have everybody on board this morning. I've got to say a big hi to George Prophet. Nice to have you on board, George. And uh, also a good friend of ours, Terry Van Cannon, is joining us. Uh, Louis Lodette, also in there, a big up international artist. Yes, absolutely. York. York? Yeah. York's in there as well. Yeah. Hello, brother man. Nice to have you on board. And believe me, you also know Viking Queen very, very well. And you know what's been going on lately. Uh, things have changed within Viking Queen, but we're going to talk about that. But first of all, we want to talk about Global Metalists United. And uh, we are united. There was a reason that was put together. And I see uh, also uh, Tim from The Mighty One taking a very prominent part in that track. Nice to have you on board, guys. Welcome back to Galaxy. Thank you. And what I can say, hell yeah. <laughs> hell yeah, absolutely. I use the hell out of hell yeah, i got to be honest with you, my friend. Uh, now, Francis, nice to catch up with you again. Hey, thank you so much for inviting me to be in uh, your program in Galaxy Radio. And I'm so happy to be here. Well, I, I think you're brave, actually. I really do. Staying up as late as you have just to talk to us down here, down under, in the other side of the world. So thank you so much for taking the time out, guys, for doing this. Uh, now, we kicked off uh, the show with Global Metalists United. Now, this, there was a purpose for this particular track, We Are United. Let's refresh our audio audience's minds. Why was this track put together? Uh, I can tell you about that. Uh, there was a one night I sitting up and take some drinks, some I used to do, and uh, I think about what happening in the world. I was writing the text, and uh, after that, so I called him. We must do this. We must really make this song together. I call York, and so we make this together, every fucking thing. And I have a lot of artists with us, beautiful artists. And we working two weeks from, uh, we starting to everything was out. 
and we have this Intel of uh, Red Cross widows and everything to Ukraine. And this is uh, also the song means so much for me about what happened in the world and what happened in the world, Ukraine and everything. And uh, It was so fucking fast. I don't sleep. Tim don't sleep. Jörg don't sleep. We work all night. Every fucking hour. And we... Also that's happening. And... Uh, and... Um, yeah, the song come out. With uh, my record label. And... Uh, I really hope the... It means something about the audience, you know. Absolutely. Uh, now, dear, at the same time, uh, this is for um, a promotion, basically, to uh, raise money, not only awareness, but to raise money for the people of Ukraine. How's that going? Yeah. Uh, are, are you making anything on that? Yeah, no, 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 something. We are one common friend. It's the same. We have the same borders as the Ukrainian. We scared of it. We want to support them. Yeah, believe me, I am right there with you, my friend. Believe me, I really, really am. I'm really concerned about you guys, to be very honest with you. Uh, but yeah. having said that, if somebody wanted to buy the uh, particular track, how do they go about doing that to be able to donate that money to the good cause? Yeah, uh, I can download everything from every platform, from Spotify to Vim to everywhere. And uh, and uh, I know Tim have a a, a plan about uh, to release out uh, uh, so the music for the Ukraine, so they can buy, you know. Uh, and the same is now too; they can buy everything. Very very so, cool. Uh, now, Jörg's online right now, and he's saying to me the album will be released May 20 uh, by Tim yep. Steinrach. Uh, it will be sold on Bandcamp to donate the money. There you go. Go and check out Global Artists United. Go and acquire. We are united on Bandcamp. Uh, that money gets donated to the uh, appropriate places in the Ukraine. It really, really does. Now, uh, guys... I'm very, very excited about this because uh, as soon as I heard this, and I was saying, you know, uh, my favourite pastime is actually driving my car sideways past, I had to play this particular track in my car, and believe me, I've got a very nice stereo in my car. Fight for Glory. Tell me about this. This is really an awesome track. Love, love, love it. Tell me all about it. Uh, it it's the same. I wake up. My evening, I go down to my floor and relax and go to my bar, something I used to do, <laughs> and take some drinks and buy things come out. And this is the song for, also if you listen to Fight for Glory, it's a really wacky song to Walhara and everything. This is a celebration song to the, all, to the war. And they really, really is crazy, the Vikings. And, uh, and, uh, and, every, no, 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 no. and everything see in the Walhara, you know? Uh, and um, this is a spirit song. Now, so, uh, uh, now, at the same time, Francis, uh, you seem to have absolutely put your stamp all over Viking Queen right now. Uh, and, and this particular track, tell me your interpretation of this particular song. Well, uh, when Gary presented me the idea to make uh, this uh, new song, Fight for glory. Uh, I know that uh, in some way or another, it's going to be uh, an, another another thing 
from from what this band had from before because uh, you know uh hung up the gods is an album where a, a female singer uh, make a, a beautiful work uh, with a nice quality but now is is my turn so uh, i had to try to find a way to to give uh, my own identity to this song always in uh, looking for the best for the song and uh, it was uh, incredibly um, for me amazing in a way to to cooperate with these people because actually i don't know so much uh, the musicians in the bands i just know these people one month ago every, everything that has happened in in my life in the last time it has been kind of a surprise from the moment that Gail called me and said, hey, you know, we think that you can make an audition for our band because we need a singer and blah, blah, blah. And then uh, start an, uh, a, st a story, start from that. And then uh, in one moment, I, I face this song in the rehearsals and then I, we have to go to a studio. And uh, my way to make an interpretation of this song is, is about to never uh, and never surrender, you know, never surrender in your dreams, never surrender in your in your goals. Always trying to to fight for what you believe. Uh, of course, this is an epic song that uh, is is about warriors and about pala environment, blah, blah blah blah. But I take it in a more personal way, and uh, and this is my approach to to make my performance on the studio. Well, I think Francis, you've done a superlative job. I really do. Uh, I think you're going to be a big star. Yeah, what what's happening? Yeah. Right? I will tell you. Also, this is a spirit song for Ukraine too, because uh, it is quite to glory, you know, so they can listen to uh, it. Also, what's happening in the world now, and uh, and uh, I am really happy to write this song to what happening and uh, I really hope for peace well Everything. yes absolutely we um, <laughs> we kind of think that <laughs> Putin has got a little off field right now he needs to get himself back on track to be honest with you uh, he's yeah. gone, gone a bit weird uh, now if you want to get hold of Viking Queen you can always do the Facebook bi uh, score Viking Queen uh, in brackets fan page Instagram is score Viking Queen Official, uh, also YouTube, score Viking Queen Official, and web, of course, is web, score Viking Queen Shop dot com, which indicates to me that they have some merch. Believe me, go and check that out. But in the meantime, for the very first time, we are officially releasing this here at Galaxy as Viking Queen, the new Viking Queen Fight for Glory. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry guys, I do. Uh, so good to hear you. Magello Magello is joining us. Hello brother man, nice to have you on board again, it really is. Uh, never surrender, I absolutely agree. Never, ever. Life on your knees, no. Nah, never done it, never will. <laughs> ever. Um, <clears throat> so, are we going to get something new very, very shortly by the sounds that you're saying that there's a new album coming out? Yeah, I'm excited. We have the new album in uh, the Working Queen. I think uh, the album will come out in September, October, and uh, and so we have some new um, stuff in from Global. So we have uh, starting with nice, it, nice. It, um, something will happen soon. Awesome. That means you guys are going to come back. That means more late nights, more drinking. Yeah. <laughs> Chris Andreas is joining us. Brother man. How are you, Chris? It is an absolute pleasure to see you again. It really is. Looking forward to new work for you. I really, really am. That's <laughs> I'm worried about Gears one. It doesn't seem to stay on. Oh, 
Och så Och så har du Som plan för oss att komma över Det nu we we can work something out believe me we really can yeah. we've got a great yeah. team with us we're already uh looking at doing stuff through tourism in different different countries yeah. and new zealand so yeah. believe me you're coming in at the right time to mention this i use the same poster so we used last time to change only the the year yeah yeah absolutely well i'll tell you what um let's talk about that with barbara very you know later on after we yeah. do this uh, because honestly we would love to have you we've been wanting to have you guys in new zealand for three a long years. time three what three years yeah three, three years, years. Yeah. so uh, yeah, but now people next year we will kick some fucking ass in new zealand i i don't know whether to be happy or scared <laughs> scared <laughs> <laughs> what do you think uh, what do i think i think either if somebody doesn't get gray hair out of this then it ain't a bloody good time <laughs> if, if they come to my place, I'll empty it because Robert can't go swimming in it. I'm yeah, sorry, yeah, yeah. Robert. Um, Barbara says if you if you go to her place, she's going to have to empty the swimming pool because Robert. Yeah, but I was <laughs> swimming in that too because I want to have swimming 100 meters ass pool. Okay, okay. Yeah. I'm not sure what an ass pool is, but that's scary in its own right. <laughs> we'll take you down to the beach instead. Yeah. <laughs> oh no, not our beach. Yeah. Gonna do this thing, I mean, we win. Yeah. Thank you. Galaxy. <laughs> Another Lindy Artist interview brought to you by Galaxy 107 FM in association with Rise Up TV. Please record in Sony News and Pew Watcher. Absolutely love, love, love that. And uh, we are in negotiations to get Viking Queen here in New Zealand. We're going to be talking about that. And we will keep you informed of how that progress is going. We really, really will. Uh, and believe me, uh, <laughs> it's going to be a lot of fun if the boys come to New Zealand. Uh, let's run it down. Uh, Robert on guitar, of course, Andreas on guitar, Roy on bass and Jan on drums. And now, new lead singer Francis on vocals. Believe me, the new look Viking Queen is going to be a force in the music world. Keep an eye out for them. Believe me, you're going to love them. Gentlemen, thank you very much for uh, joining us and staying up so late. Um, I, I hope there's uh, a lot more drinking going on before bedtime. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not so sure about Francis is going on. I'm thinking about my throat. <laughs> it's a very important uh, part in our life in the Viking Queens to have always uh, good drinks. With us, yeah. <laughs> it's part of our uh, spirit. <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah. Now, at the same time, and I know that you've had a good friend with you right there, Rob, uh, Deb. You, when we do this tour, you were saying that you were looking at bringing the uh, Norwegian Rednecks down here, right? the TV show. Yeah. I'm liking that idea. I might be able to hook you up with another. Also, about this uh, next year, he told me, and. Uh, to join the Viking Queen when we go uh, come over. Okay, well, let me tell you something. Uh, we are now in association with Rise Up TV, uh, Big Record, yeah. and also uh, <laughs> Sony Music, The Orchard. As you would know with Tim, uh, we, we kind of uh, got involved with that. So you, we might be able to, you know, if you talk to us and you talk to Tim and we get everything going and you talk to, uh, to the Rednecks, you never know, we might be able to get you hooked up with Rise Up TV. We can do a collab thing all around the world. What do you reckon? Of course. Uh, and I think this will be the craziest time New Zealand have seen before. Absolutely. Well, we are bringing 
Rise Up TV to New Zealand. We're going to be doing a documentary with those guys here in New Zealand. Why not get them involved with what you're doing as well in Norway? Get you over there in Canada, and you never know, they may bring you here as well because they do want to bring bands. Yeah, that's true. That's true. I love that idea. Keep in touch with Barbara, my friend. Believe me, she <laughs> will have a chat to you about it. In fact, uh, Pamela from uh, Rise Up TV and Big Records is watching right now, so... Uh, I've already let the cat out of the bag, haven't I? <laughs> yeah, believe me. Uh, so we will discuss that one very, very shortly. Guys, thank you so much for joining us. Don't go anywhere just yet. And uh, believe me, it is an absolute pleasure to have everybody joining us, not only from Rise Up TV, Big Record and Sony Music The Orchard, but everybody that's watching this. If you're going to watch it over there on YouTube, don't forget, sub, thumb, bell. Bingo. Have a good day. <laughs>